Prince Frederick was not a favorite of Queen Margaret's until very recently. Welcome to our channel, before we continue, please subscribe to stay updated with latest information from the Danish royal family. Just weeks after the death of Queen Elizabeth II, Denmark's Queen Margrethe made international headlines after she abruptly removed the royal titles of four of her grandchildren. All of their royal titles were removed from Prince Joachim's four children and he was very upset by this, as were his ex-wife and his current wife. He gave several interviews about how hurt he was by his mother's decision, and he and his wife even indicated that they were essentially exiled to France several years ago, expelled from the royal court, and it was not their decision. Joachim also seemed to indicate that there was a deeper rupture not only with his mother, but with his brother Frederick, the crown prince. Shortly thereafter, Queen Margaret made a stunning public apology to Joachim and his children, but did not reverse her decision. Still, the apology seemed to work, as did a sort of informal mother-son summit. It has been very quiet in the garbage house in Glucksburg ever since. Well, Vanity Fair did an in-depth article about the history of Queen Margaret's reign, her new marriage and her relationships with her two sons. You can read the whole piece here there is a lot of gossip about her marriage, but I wanted to quote a few things about her relationships with Crown Prince Frederick and Prince Joachim. Some highlights. Well, this piece made me hate Frederick a little bit. I never formed an opinion of him other than how easy it seemed. But Frederick seems to be all oh my god, lies heavy-headed who was a crown while encouraging his mother to pull off these machinations to banish Joachim. It is rather an open question, from what I can see, as to why Joachim and Mary were exiled to France for longer than three years and who ordered what. Mary and Joachim say it wasn't their call. Was it just Queen Margaret's call? Or did Frederick have a say in the matter too? I wonder what else Margaret has in store to tidy up her house too, because there seem to be shoes left to drop. Thanks for watching till the end, please don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more updates.